What's going on YouTube? My name is Will and uh, from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel and you can also check me online at www.whatsupinthesky.com is my new website. Got all sorts of good stuff on there including pictures like this from the Lunar Orbiter that was uh, back in I think 66 and 67. These were uh, basically taken by a satellite and then pieced back together. Um, where we found a couple anomalies. I'm going to call this one the dugout. And it looks like it's on a very dark spot there and it's very rectangular. When I pull out, you're going to check this whole area out here. Um, that's for the people who want to come and see it real fast and get on out of it. There's uh, also a lot of symmetrical rectangular type structures up here. Now let me go ahead and uh, take you, show you real quick how you find it. Here it is right here. Now there's a bunch of awesome ones out there. Now make sure you get the TIFF because the TIFF file is really big. Um, but it'll pull down the resolution, the best resolution you can get. So, alright, let me minimize that. And we'll go back to here. Alright, so let me reset this to the way it looked. So this is how it comes uh, when you download it directly. And let me pull you where I found that part of it. There's a lot going on in this picture. There's a place that kind of looks like the Inca City up around this part. Um, but first, let's go back down there and, and take a good look at the uh, that dugout area. This uh, whole area seems to be, see, see this kind of trench here? The uh, interesting S-curve and how it moves out. Very, uh, very worked. So you've got the triangle, or the uh, rectangular type buildings here. And uh, I'm not sure what these spots are, but they are in multiple photos. See how the film strips are cut there but uh, these actually are in a lot of the you know, these are actually in a lot of them if you look at the lunar orbiter ones some of them are in really neat patterns too so who knows what this stuff is let me see if I can bring up the levels a little bit maybe bring up some exposure so this looks like to be uh, a nice building a pretty fairly large building on the side of a crater or side of this whatever this is see how long here the uh, this land slopes down like this could be coming down that takes a pretty quick drop off but it actually looked like it'd be pretty cool if you had a sled you could hit that up if it was snow now let me take you up here see if I can find that Inca city again let me reset this so we can actually try and get where are you up oh, here's some of them here these so yeah, they've got like if you look over in Egypt, if you go pull up Google Earth and look at Egypt, a lot of it looks like this. Now this right here, these are just part of the camera. These are uh you know the the focusing marks, the they are embedded in the film. But here this looks like a city. Um laid out. See the long stretch here, maybe it's a long building, you've got some other ones. Um I'm thinking that if maybe from radiation and people had to live under the surface of the moon if they were up there living here again you've got structures straight lines one two three one two three and then this look seems to be connected to something there this whole picture is pretty cool and if you go download it this uh, like I said you could do this yourself easily I'm on a iMac 27 inch right here that's why I get for the resolution looks so good if you're in HD um, well as low as it is here's the other part up here okay let me gank the contrast a little bit not that much and then sharpen it so see all the symmetrical parts there that looks like the Inca City it looks like kind of like Machu Picchu if you looked up on the mountains of it um, but anyway, hope you guys enjoy it. Just a couple from the moon. I haven't hit too many moon videos. I'm, I know I've been lacking on them, slacking. So, uh, I don't know, it almost looks like it could be a, a giant face. But, uh, you know, I think that's there because of the eye, the, the marks. But it uh, could be. Alright, much love guys. Take it easy. Hope you subscribe. Enjoy. I have a lot more to come. I'm going to try and hit every anomaly like ever done. So this page should keep growing over the next couple of years. Take care.